Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today in this video, I am going to write a big essay on forest, its interaction, types of forest and conclusion. So, I hope you all might like this video. So, let's get started. A forest is a vast land that encompasses a large number of trees, shrubs and other varieties of plants. Forests also consist of mosses, fungi and algae. These forests are a home for a wide variety of birds, reptiles, microorganisms, insects and animals. Forests maintain biodiversity on earth and thus are important for maintaining a healthy environment on the planet. Types of Forest Forests around the world have been classified into different categories and here are various types of forests that form a part of the earth's ecological system. Coming to the first one, Tropical Rainforest.
tropical rain forest these are extremely dense forest and majorly or entirely consist of evergreen trees that remain green all around the year These forests are devoid of enough sunlight and thus mostly dark and damp. They receive plenty of rainfall all around the year but still the temperature is high here as they are located near the equator. Numerous species of animals, birds and fishes breed here. Next, subtropical forest. Subtropical forest. These forests are situated at the north and south of the tropical forests. These forests mostly experience drought like situation. The trees and plants here are adapted to sustain the summer drought. Next one, deciduous forest. These forests are mainly home for trees that lose their leaves every year. Deciduous forests mostly penetrate in regions that experience mild winters and warm in moist summers. These can be found in different parts of the world including Europe, 
North America New Zealand Asia and Australia Walnut Oak Maple Chestnut trees are mostly found here Next temperate forest temperate forest see the growth of deciduous and coniferous evergreen trees located in northeastern asia eastern north america western and eastern europe these forests receive enough rain fall coming to the next one mountain forest these are known as the cloud forest This is because these forests receive most of their downpour from the fog or mist that comes from the lowlands. These are mostly located in the tropical, subtropical and temperate zones. These forests experience cold weather as well as intense sunlight conifers occupy large part of this forest next plantation forest plantation forest these are basically large farms that grow cash crops such as coffee tea sugarcane oil palms cotton and oil seeds
plantation forest produce about 40% of the industrial wood These are particularly known for producing sustainable timber and fiber. Next, Mediterranean forest. Mediterranean forest. These forests are situated around the coasts of the Mediterranean, Chile, California, and Western Australia. These have a mix of softwood and hardwood trees and almost all the trees here are evergreen. Next, coniferous forest. Coniferous forest. These forests are found near the poles, mainly the northern hemisphere, and experience a cold and windy climate all through the year. They experience the growth of hardwood and conifer trees. The growth of pines, firs, spruces is a common sight here. The conifer trees are evergreen and well adapted to the drought like conditions here. Conclusion Forests are a beautiful creation of nature.
different parts of our planet encompass different types of forest that are home for various plants and animals and a means of livelihood for numerous people so i hope that i have covered all the points regarding the topic forest its introduction and types of forest along with its conclusion so this is the video on the topic forest and i hope that this video might useful to everyone to understand easily and how many types of forest are there here around the world and what are their characters etc etc so i hope you all might like this video for more videos and updates please do subscribe and support my channel encourage me thank you for watching